Most Holy Father, the English-speaking visitors and pilgrims present today wish to express to you their sentiments of respect and esteem, and to assure you of their prayers for your ministry as the successor of Peter. At the end of the audience, we will sing together the Our Father in Latin. The Holy Father will then impart his apostolic blessing, which he willingly extends to the members of your families at home. His Holiness also intends to bless any religious articles you may have brought for this purpose. And in a special way, his blessing goes to your children and to your loved ones who are sick. The following is a summary in English of the Holy Father's words this morning. In our catechesis on the Creed, we pass now from the article on the Holy Spirit to that on the Church, one holy, Catholic, and apostolic. The Holy Spirit and the Church are in fact inseparable. The Spirit enlivens and guides the Church and each of us within the church to carry out Christ's mandate to make disciples of all peoples. He opens minds and hearts to the beauty and truth of the gospel. The Spirit overcomes selfishness and division, creating unity, communion, reconciliation, and love. The Spirit also instills the strength needed to bear courageous witness to the risen Christ. He is the Spirit of mission and evangelization. The fire of the Holy Spirit was sent down upon the apostles at Pentecost in answer to their fervent prayer. Ardent prayer in the Spirit must always be the soul of new evangelization and the heart of our lives as Christians. Let us renew each day our trust in the working of the Holy Spirit, open our hearts to his inspiration and gifts, and strive to be signs of unity and communion with God in the midst of our human family. Cari fratelli, vi invito tutti a pregare con me per le vittime, specialmente i bambini, del disastro in Oklahoma. Il Signore Il Signore consoli tutti, in particolare i genitori che hanno perso così tragicamente un loro figlio. Saluto cordialmente i pellegrini di lingua inglese presenti all'odierna udienza, specialmente quelli provenienti da Inghilterra, Irlanda, India, Canada e Stati Uniti. Saluto in modo particolare i gruppi di pellegrini dell'Archidiocesi di Hartford e dell'Università Cattolica di America. In questi giorni in cui la Chiesa celebra la discesa dello Spirito Santo nella Pentecoste, invoco su tutti voi e le vostre famiglie i Suoi doni di sapienza e pace. Dio vi benedica. There now follows a translation into English of the Holy Father's greeting. Dear brothers and sisters, I invite all of you to pray with me for the victims, especially the children, of the disaster in Oklahoma. May the Lord himself console everyone, in particular parents who have lost a child in such a tragic way. I offer a cordial welcome to all the English-speaking pilgrims and visitors present at today's audience, including those from England, Ireland, India, Canada, and the United States. My special greeting goes to the pilgrims from the Archdiocese of Hartford and the Alumni Association of the Catholic University of America. 
In these days when the Church celebrates the descent of the Holy Spirit at Pentecost, I invoke upon you and your families his gifts of wisdom and peace. God bless you all.